Welcome to the gripping world of a television classic that has withstood the test of time Alfred Hitchcock presents. What enduring qualities render this series a timeless emblem of the industry? Perhaps it's the masterful blend of suspense, wit, and Hitchcock's signature storytelling that keeps audiences captivated even decades later. Do you have a cherished memory associated with this iconic series? As we explore the layers of Alfred Hitchcock Presents, we invite you to reflect on your personal experiences. We would love to hear your stories and memories in the comments below. Setting the stage for this journey, let's uncover some intriguing facts about the show. Alfred Hitchcock Presents, with its anthology format, unfolded tales of mystery and intrigue, often leaving viewers on the edge of their seats. The show's unique narrative structure, coupled with Hitchcock's cameo appearances and dry humor, etched it into the collective memory of television enthusiasts. Now, let's delve into the heart of the matter. Hitchcock's keen eye for detail and his ability to craft compelling narratives turned each episode into a cinematic experience within the confines of a living room. The series not only showcased his directorial prowess, but also served as a breeding ground for emerging talents in the industry. What about you? What's your most cherished memory or personal experience related to this timeless series? Feel free to share your thoughts below. As we celebrate the enduring legacy of Alfred Hitchcock Presents, we invite you to join the conversation. Share your insights, reminisce about your favorite episodes, and let the nostalgia flow. Your unique perspectives contribute to the rich tapestry of appreciation for this television masterpiece. We would love to hear your stories and memories in the comments below. Happy reminiscing! Alfred Hitchcock's iconic TV series, known for its suspenseful narratives, underwent intriguing changes from its source material. Take, for instance, an unlocked window adapted from Ethel Lyne White's short story. The original climax had Nurse Cherry unmasking the disguised killer, Edward Leakes, in a stormy struggle. However, the teleplay altered this, with Nurse Ames intentionally revealing herself as Leakes before chillingly dispatching Nurse Crossing. Hitchcock himself suggested the added terror of a struggle, culminating in a shirt-ripping reveal of the killer's hairy chest. Hosting his own show elevated Hitchcock's celebrity status and bolstered his directorial profile. The TV series provided a platform that extended beyond film, making the renowned director even more prominent. Interestingly, the reach of Alfred Hitchcock Presents extended to unexpected territories. A video game adaptation surfaced in 1993 for the 3DO, developed by Toyota, and released in Japan. This unusual venture showcased the enduring appeal of Hitchcock's storytelling in diverse forms. In summary, the TV series, born from Hitchcock's directorial prowess, not only adapted tales in suspenseful ways, but also transcended the screen with unexpected adaptations, solidifying Hitchcock's legacy in entertainment. Psycho, a film famously associated with Hitchcock, almost became an episode in the television series. The sets, cameras, and crew from the show were nearly utilized for this iconic movie. Walt Disney's refusal to let Hitchcock film at Disneyland in the early 1960s due to the disgusting nature of Psycho possibly hindered an episode's creation. Additionally, in the show's final three seasons, its runtime extended to 60 minutes and was renamed the Alfred Hitchcock Hour. These instances reflect the intriguing evolution and influence of the series beyond its original format, showcasing the interplay between television and cinematic endeavors. The near crossover of Psycho into the show and its subsequent extension highlight the series' impact and the fascinating link between Hitchcock's works on both small and big screens. Alfred Hitchcock, recognized for his iconic TV series, crafted distinct opening and closing narratives for each episode, tailoring them for different audiences. For the European markets, he filmed alternate versions, as his sponsor jibes where it well received overseas. In fact, during the third season, Hitchcock delivered these segments in French and German, showcasing his fluency in both languages. Interestingly, Hitchcock's silhouette, a notable feature in the show's opening credits, was drawn by the maestro himself. His journey began as an illustrator for silent movie title cards, marking a unique start to his illustrious film career. His stamp, part of a series honoring early U.S. television, reflects the enduring impact of Alfred Hitchcock presents among the pantheon of revered TV shows. The opening and closing music for the series, Funeral March for a Marionette by Charles Downod, set the eerie tone for each episode. 
This haunting melody became synonymous with the suspenseful narratives presented in the show. Notably, the entertaining intros and outros featuring Alfred Hitchcock were all crafted by James B. Allardis. These segments, specifically tailored for different audiences, added a unique touch to the series, providing Hitchcock's signature blend of wit and suspense. One episode, An Unlocked Window, drew inspiration from real-life events, seemingly influenced by both Psycho and the Richard Speck nurse killings. Its chilling narrative captivated audiences, leading to a remake in 1985 starring Annette O'Toole and Bruce Davison. This adaptation showcased the enduring relevance and impact of the show's compelling stories. The choice of music and the creative introductions and conclusions by Al Artis contributed significantly to the series' atmosphere, setting it apart as a hallmark of suspenseful television. Each element, carefully curated, added depth and intrigue to the iconic 1955 series, leaving an indelible mark on television history. The sponsors wielded significant influence over the show's presentation. In episodes where the perpetrator got away with a crime, Hitchcock had to reassure audiences of justice in his closing monologue. This ensured a balance, aligning the sponsor's wishes with the audience's need for closure. It's intriguing how external factors shape the show's narrative, emphasizing the symbiotic relationship between artistic vision and commercial interests. This dynamic sheds light on the complexities behind the scenes, showcasing the delicate balance between creative control and external pressures in crafting suspenseful tales for the small screen. The TV show showcased Hitchcock's diverse talents, establishing him as an entertainer beyond his directorial fame. Amidst his 17 directed episodes, a significant connection emerged. The imposing Victorian Gothic mansion, prominently featured in an unlocked window, housed the hiding nurse at the same Bates house from Psycho. This link between the series and Hitchcock's iconic film added depth to his storytelling legacy. Hitchcock's direction across these episodes demonstrated his skill in crafting suspenseful narratives for television, solidifying his reputation as a master storyteller across mediums. The shared setting between an unlocked window and Psycho offers a compelling insight into Hitchcock's creative world, connecting his TV ventures to his renowned cinematic achievements. As we part ways, I'd like to invite you to delve into the mesmerizing world of that iconic television masterpiece from yesteryears, masterminded by the unparalleled Hitchcock. Take a moment to reflect on the enigmatic tales, the suspenseful narratives that stirred our imaginations and kept us glued to our seats. What memories flicker in your mind's eye? What stories linger in the corridors of your memory from those chilling episodes? Whether it's the haunting theme music that sends shivers down your spine or the thrill of Hitchcock's cameo appearances that added an extra layer of intrigue, there's something eternally captivating about this classic series. Perhaps you found yourself eagerly anticipating the twists or drawn to the moral complexities woven into each narrative, sparking contemplation long after the credits rolled. Your thoughts, musings, and favorite moments are a treasure trove a testament to the impact this show has had on its audience. Share those cherished recollections, anecdotes, or reflections with fellow enthusiasts, and keep the spirit of this timeless classic alive. Thank you for journeying through the labyrinth of memories and sentiments connected to this remarkable series. Your engagement enriches the tapestry of shared experiences, making this journey all the more delightful. Until our narratives intersect again, take care and keep the Hitchcockian intrigue alive in your own adventures.